In this movie, we go through how to download Cassandra. In a browser window, you're going to go to cassandra.apache.org, the home of Apache Cassandra. Over on the right-hand side, you see that we have the option to download the latest version of Apache Cassandra, and we'll walk through doing that. Before we do that, I just want to mention a couple other options that are also available to you. So along with being able to download Cassandra from here, you can also go to planetcassandra.org. And from there, you can download a community version of Cassandra from Datastax. Another option for downloading Cassandra is if you go to the Datastax website, they offer an enterprise version of Cassandra. So that's also Apache Cassandra plus some additional software for Cassandra to be able to communicate with other technologies such as Hadoop or Solar. We're going to be using this version. So let's go ahead and select Download Options. We notice that we have this option here to go get the tarball file. Select that. We could download it from any of these sites. If we go ahead and right click on one of them, we can choose Download Linked File As. And if we wanted to, we could then go ahead and download the tarball file. We don't need to do this because I have already gone ahead and downloaded it to our virtual machine. Let's go take a look at that. You can click on cancel and let's go to our virtual machine, which we opened previously. If it's gone to sleep, like mine has, go ahead and click anywhere. And then as you may recall, the password is Ubuntu in all lowercase. Once we're in here, let's open up a terminal window. And we can do that by clicking on the dash home icon in the upper left here. If we didn't already see the terminal icon here, we would be able to type in terminal and it would show up on the list. Go ahead and click on it to open up a terminal window. And where I downloaded the tarball file to is in the downloads folder. Let's do ls and we see the directories in here, including downloads. And let's go to the downloads directory. So CD for change directory, and then downloads, enter. Do another LS to list the contents of this directory. And there we see our tarball file. This is how to download Cassandra. And as we go forward, we'll be installing it.